Okay, so SEO or search engine optimization. It is so important for video content. Having good SEO visibility really determines whether your video is gonna get seen or not. It's really that simple. So here are three ways that you can increase the chances of your video content, your images, or even your website getting ranked higher in Google searches. First off, keyword tags. You probably already understand what keyword tags are, but the question is, are you using them effectively? You have to choose keyword tags that are not only relevant to your content, but specific enough to allow the search engine algorithm to wade through the broadness of a topic and get down to what your video is all about and then pull it. Keyword tags should be used in both their singular and their compound forms. For example, if you're trying to showcase, let's say a wedding video that was shot in Brooklyn, New York, your keywords should include wedding, video, Brooklyn, maybe New York individually, and then Brooklyn wedding video New York in one keyword term. Use as many keyword tags as you can wherever you post your video, every time you're given the opportunity to keyword tag, especially on YouTube. YouTube is the second largest search engine in the world. It is a Google property. You can use a browser extension tool like vidIQ, uh, and it'll help you search other keyword terms that other videos have had success with, and then you can pull them and you can em emulate them in your video, and then add your own to make your video more visible. Next up, titles and descriptions. You have to write titles and a description that is attention grabbing, informative, and ones that include your own keywords, your main keywords. So think of it like writing news headlines. The title has to be catchy, almost like clickbait to make it attractive to a viewer, and then also easy for Google to match in search results and then return them. Titles should never be as long as you're allowed to make them, but also not too short. And your description should always include the same exact text of your title in the very beginning, and should also include some more descriptive terms to help get it ranked higher. So another tip that will help you to get your video ranked higher in search pages is, is link backs. These are just where, you know, links to other websites. The more you spread your video around the internet, think of it like, like seeds, uh, like, like seeding grass. It's going to be seen more, right? It's going to attract engagement and then it's going to rank higher. So having your video embedded in other websites also gives the content validity and the more people who view it will make, it'll make it rank higher, especially if you have your keywords, your title, and your description all dialed in the way you're supposed to. Hosting a video on your own website, by the way, can be detrimental uh, rather than hosting it someplace else and then embedding it back on your site because if your website's not optimized correctly for SEO, it just means that the video is probably gonna lay in obscurity on your obscure website. So get it out there, Vimeo, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok even, these social platforms are becoming the hottest source for new video content and massive engagement. Be sure to utilize keyword tags on all of these platforms whenever possible to increase visibility in search engine results. I hope this helps you out. I, you know, I want you to, do, to understand also that there's so much you can do to improve SEO performance on your videos, which will lead to more traffic wherever you're trying to drive it. But you also have to understand that doing SEO is a marketing thing and it's a full-time job. And the algorithm is always changing. So you know, chances are you're gonna have to learn this information and update your knowledge of this information over time often because it changes constantly and what was effective today may not be effective in the future. So overall, I hope this gives you a couple of tips to help you improve your SEO performance. Now, I'm Rob Adams for Shuttermag. Till next time.